nose and all English night, and I just want to introduce you to a little sweetie, Miss Florence Desmond. I'm going to give you my idea of a party given in Hollywood by Janet Gaynor. For this occasion, we'll suppose it's her birthday, and I want you to imagine you're there with me, meeting all your favorite film stars. I'll introduce you to Janet Gaynor, and she'll tell you all about it herself. Hello, everybody. I'm giving a little party tonight. I've never given a party like this before. I have all kinds of celebrities coming along. There's Greta Garbo, Marlene Dietrich, Tallulah, and a whole lot of other people. And I got a big surprise for you. Miss Gracie Fields arrived in Hollywood today, and I've asked her to come along, too. Well, I guess I'm all set. Why, here they are now. Oh, Zazu Pitts. Why, I never thought you'd come along. Say, you're the only person who ever get me to go to a party. I suppose I have to wish you many happy returns of the day. But why anybody wants to go on living these days, I can't imagine. <laughs> Schnuzzle, Jimmy Duran. Oh, come in. Ah, how are you, Johnny, baby? How are you? It's me, Schnuzzle Duran, one-time star of Broadway, now working in Hollywood. What a come down. Oh, mortify. Oh, mortify. Oh, I got a present for you, Janet. Oh, Jimmy, how sweet of you. Why, it's a pair of... That's okay. I got a million of them, ah, I got a million of them. <laughs> Quiet, everybody. Here's Grady Garbo. Oh, oh, there you are, Janet. I didn't see you at first. You are so, so little. Oh, will you please take my Macintosh? I'm afraid it is very wet. I have been fishing with Clark Gable. <laughs> oh, I hope you don't mind. I have brought my own supper. You see, I only like my own cooking. Oh, Janet, have you a little corner where I can be by myself? Oh, no. No, don't introduce me to anyone, please. I want to be alone. Oh, please leave me alone. I'm so tired. Oh, I think I go home. I think I go home. <laughs> Will you be all right there, Greta? I've just seen Tallulah Bankhead coming in. Oh, darling, yes, you are. It's too marvelous you are. I can't bear it. <laughs> oh, Janet, what a fine house. And it's so sweet of it to ask me here, really. <laughs> oh, Tallulah, I want to introduce you to Greta Garbo. Oh, I've been dying to know her. Where is she? What is she doing here? I thought she never went to parties. Or did she know I was coming? Oh, uh, Miss Garbo, this is Tallulah Bankhead. How do you do? Oh, I'm crazy to meet you. I adore your pictures. In fact, I'm an absolute fan of yours. Oh, you're very kind, but who are you? Are you an actress? Oh, my God! <laughs> <laughs> so, the door of love, and I thought I'd come in. Hope you don't mind. Oh, welcome to Hollywood, Miss Fields. I say, hope you haven't got a lot of posh people here, because if you have, I'm not coming in. Oh, no. I just want to introduce you to Greta Garbo. Uh, Miss Garbo, this is Miss Gracie Fields. How do you do? Hey, I'm nicely, thanks. Love mustn't and crumble. Oh, uh, Miss Fields, what would you like to eat? Would you like some caviar, or corn on the cob, or a pumpkin pie? <clears throat> I suppose you haven't got any tripe and onions, have you, love? Oh, I'm not fussy, I'll eat anything. Oh, Miss Fields, while we're waiting for the supper, would you sing us one of those cute little English songs of yours? Well, I've done a few things in my time, Duck, but I've never sung for me supper. All right, I don't mind. Fill it up, Professor, will you? Mm. Oh, 
They do that sort of thing here. Sing. Never mind the weather, never mind the rain. As long as we're together, whoop, she goes again. I, I, I say, man, are they shooting at us? I don't think so. Not yet. Sing. la di da di da la di da di di All good pals and jolly good company. I say, old man, it's getting worse. Well, don't be absurd. It's no worse than England on the 5th of November. Look out, the manager. Say, listen, you two guys. I told you so, 5th of November. We got a tough bunch out there tonight. It's Al Sharpshot's birthday party. What oh, many have to return? Ah, oh, listen, the rival gang are out to get him. Get him what? Oh, can it. They're full of liquor. They can't aim straight. They just shoot anywhere. Now it's up to you two guys to amuse them and keep them quiet. That's why I engage personality turns. And you ain't made no impression yet. Oh, they're quiet now because they're reloading. Oh, they're easy. If they like you, they laugh. If they don't, they shoot. Go ahead. Sing. Here we are again. Happy as can be. All good pals and jolly good company. Yeah, Stop are. singing. Stop singing. Is a man getting a machine gun out? Well, 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 as the man said when he came out of the nursing home. <laughs> try another, try another. What did the earwig say? <laughs> oh, wait for the finish. Wait for the finish. What did the earwig say when it fell off the twig? Here we go. <laughs> I think they've heard it. Try the notebooks. Say! Here we are again. Happy What's the big idea? What are you two guys trying to do? Funny better. Ain't you got nothing with some pep in it? Oh, rather, yes. We've got our laughing chorus. Chuckle, giggle and laugh. By Jove, yes. That'll make anybody laugh. Well, come on. Let's hear it. How's it go? Well, very well if it's a good audience. Well, let them have it. Shoot. For him? No. Make me laugh. One, two. If you're unhappy and feeling rather blue, chuckle and giggle and laugh. Just make it snappy and laugh and chuckle.
the six bips. Beautifully timed program. Not a minute too long, I hope. I hope you're not in a hurry to get home. I am. Goodbye. <laughs>